All right. Good day, Guardian. So many builds out this season. It's quite ridiculous. One I've been using. It's really fun. I'm the Hunter. We'll be using Blade Brush, Highest DPS Super, Gambler's Touch. Get our melee back. I like Triple Jump, Proximity Knives. We're just gonna go with our Exotic. I'm using Healing Grenades. I'm trying to be the Immortal War uh, Hunter here. Knock them down. It's gonna be Radiant. Whatever I'm Radiant, I'm gonna reimburse my melee. Uh, on your mark, mainly for the Fragrance slots, but it's also like a nice Dragon Shadow. Um, these fragments, I'm using Singeing to get my class ability back. I'm using Empyrean to ex to restore my restoration and radiant effects. Torches is going to give me my radiant when I do a melee powered attack. Eruption is going to increase the effects of ignition. This whole thing's going to be doing a lot of that. Searing is going to increase my melee regeneration when I ever scorch anything. I'm using the new DPS combo thing. We're doing Wither Horde and Storm Chaser. Literally any Storm Chaser is pretty good right now. I would suggest Clown Cartridge like Vorpal or Clown Cartridge Frenzy or Clown Cartridge Firing Line. Those are my suggestions. I have what I got until I get a better one. This is something that you're definitely going to want to make for yourself. This pulls it together very nicely. A callus mini tool. We're going to do an, the enhanced incandescence. This is going to make the scorch burns last longer. If they last longer, it's also more DPS, but it also helps my ability regeneration gain. The enhanced threat detector, because I'm trying to make this thing as much of a stat monster as I can. I'm also doing flare make well decrease the reload speed and fluted barrel decrease the handling. I'm just trying to stat it out as far as I can. You notice I have a Dragonfly spec here. This thing about the incandescent that I don't understand yet it says spread scorch, but seemingly, if you shoot somebody in the foot and they die on any subclass with incandescent, doesn't matter if it's solar, they do an ignition. They just blow up. It does about 3,000 damage in regular. Threw that spec on, it adds an extra grand, about 4,000 on the initial blast. Doesn't affect the burn, but it affects the blast. Now I'll do the mods here real quick. I use the harmonic siphon to make orbs. Uh, high energy fire to decrease damage. Now radiant is a damage boost, high energy fire is a damage boost, and phantom might all stack. They're all damage boosts and they all stack on top of each other. You can have somebody else debuff it with the Treachery Cannon Divinity and Tether. It's it's phenomenal. The damage you can punch out. Uh, I use hands on to get my super back and I balance out my stats with you know whatever. Mobility strength or whatever. Now I'm centering around the Caliban's ham. This is going to turn my proximity knife not only scorch, but on direct hits, they will do an ignition. That's very important. And if my proximity knife is totally with, lay on the ground, not only are there traps, but they'll help my melee regeneration here. You can go with any mods you really want. Um, since you're doing PvE, you're going to be going anti-barrier champion mods. If you're going for PvP with a similar build, you can go stasis made a kickstarter the resistance is really nice so you're going to want those straight from the artifact mod selection pool there i'm using elemental charge to become charged with light with my wells i'm making wells with the melee well maker i always choose choose void boots because they allow me to have better already which is another way to heal um <laughs> doing both classy restoration and solar what is this called fulmination the classy restoration every time I dodge it's gonna give me uh, eh, god mode you're gonna keep regenerating health so fast that it's almost impossible to die um, we're gonna 
using the solar illumination to also increase the blast radius of our ignitions even more. These things are like little mini nukes, really. I could do it with both the melee and the callus mini tool. I took this into dungeon, took this into raids, and I rarely ever had to change anything for any encounter. Just give you an idea here. We're gonna burn that guy, burn that guy, burn this dude. Hit that bad? You just gonna burn and give me my melee? I mean, my dodge? Yeah, this is just. It's fun. Uh, one thing you can do though is accidentally kill yourself with your own ignitions. So, be on top of that. But, yep, yeah, this is just all around pretty fun build. I hope you enjoy it.